What's up, people? This is BellerV201 with another Arduino video. Um, I think my last one was a PIR alarm. You should go check that out. I have a couple of other Arduino videos. Very helpful. I do things that um, a lot of people do not do or uh, do not make videos for. And um, one of those videos is how to control servos with a USB joystick. As you can probably tell already, this uh, joystick is not USB anymore. Here's the old USB cord right here, but we don't need that because I hacked it. I have this gray cable. It's a Cat5 cable coming out of here, out of the uh, bottom of the joystick here. And um, that leads right into my Arduino Uno and ProtoShield. These two brown wires are from the X and Y axis on the joystick here. Um, these two green wires go to the power on the mini circuit board that's in here to control the USB communication. And all those do is uh, keep me from having to re rewire all of the um, positives and negatives for the switches and for the potentiometers. I currently have four switches, which uh, none of them are hooked up. All the wires are right here. It's uh, this trigger button on top and then these two buttons down here. So I have two analog outputs and four digital outputs from this joystick. And the other two are power. So until I find a little bit larger cable, I won't have all of the uh, other... I think there's about seven more buttons and another potentiometer, which is this right here, that I could have put an output to, but have decided not to. So, these are cool little servos. They're just uh, they're micro 9G servos. They're fairly small. So here's my thumb compared to those. So, um... Uh, Every, when, whenever you move the joystick, it moves the servos, so you have your y-axis in the back there. Then you have your x-axis in the front. And you can, they'll, they'll both move independently at the same time. I just took the, um, the knob on the, um, Arduino code examples list. I adapted that to run two servos at a time. And then I put in the values for this. It was about 179 to 800 something was the approximate um, ratio, uh, span for these potentiometers because it's limited by the joystick. But um, there are some uh, cool projects out there that you can do with this. If you have any uh, questions on how I did this, um, please send me a comment. I have a couple other videos on... Um, what this looks like when it's open, um, but uh, if anybody needs to see those, I'll post them, but otherwise I will not. So this is the easy way to control a Arduino joystick and servos all together without a computer. Otherwise you'd have to use a program like Python or Processing to be able to get this power right here. It is a little bit sketchy. Um, it doesn't work too well. Well, actually it works quite well. It's just there's a little bit of a bounce back. It's kind of jittering right now because of the transmission here from the potentiometers. But uh, thank you very much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Go ahead and check out some of my other videos. If you need to see how I did all this stuff, just go ahead and post a comment. Thank you.